Hey guys, today I'm going to be filming a review slash haul of the company Curiology. I've bought quite a few things from their store and I thought that some of you might also like their things, so here we go. This is what the packaging of the box looks like before I throw the card out. They've got the brand logo stamped on there. I'm not sure how well you can see it. And then we have a wee little business card and then on the back um, they've handwritten thank you, which is a really nice touch. So the reason that I ordered a couple of things this time is a friend of mine invited me to the Facebook page um, slash event. It wasn't really a page, I guess, but it was the Macabre Market, which was a group of independent designers who have like handmade goods and they're all alternative and gothic and just creepy in general. And what they do every now and then is they will have one night and they have this event on Facebook and every five minutes a different seller will post something that they're selling and it's usually at a discounted price or they do bundles with loads of things and you save loads of money. So yeah, it was bad that my friend invited me to this because I had no money. <laughs> but yeah, I ended up going on there anyway and obviously I found a 20% Curiology code. It was only for that night and I actually wish I'd waited because they had a really, really nice bundle that I could have got for the same price. But anyway, I used the code which I put on my website. I always put discount codes on my website in case any of you guys are like shopaholics like me. I'll leave links below to that. But this is how everything comes packaged. I love these little stripy bags. They're so pretty. And I only bought three items. But this is the first thing that I bought and it's I'm obsessed with it. I've worn it pretty much every day so far. And it's this really beautiful cat skull hair clip. They're made of acrylic and it's, this is kind of engraved and then the colour's been put into it so it doesn't feel like it's going to come off. Um, it doesn't feel cheap, it feels really well made. And then there's just a clip on the back and I'm going to put this in now because I love it. Yeah, beautiful. So the next thing I ordered is another hair clip. I haven't worn it yet because I've been obsessively wearing this one. But it's so beautiful. I really really like the pentagram underneath, it's so nice. And I don't know if you can see, but it's all made up of little tiny bones. So I really like that. Again, this is engraved and then the colour's been set into it too, so it's not going to scratch off. And then the final things that I ordered are a pair of earrings. And I've had my eyes on these for a really, really long time, but I wanted to wait until I wanted a couple of things before I went buying them. I hope my camera picks up the detail. They're these. Really, really beautiful ornate earrings and it kind of reminds me of um, Dracula's castle or a vampire castle. I don't know if you can see the bats, that's what those small black things are. I'm hoping that you can see all the detail. But again, this is acrylic cut. They don't just do acrylic cut um, pieces, but for some reason they always seem to appeal to me. I think it's because they're black. <laughs> um, I do wear jewellery that's not black, obviously, but these just, they shout out to me. Every time I see them, they just look so beautifully made. I have to order them. So I got a pair of those and I've been wearing those loads as well. I don't actually have that many pairs of dangly earrings. So when I get paid, I'm going to have to go back to the website and order some more. If you guys liked any of the pieces I showed you, I'll leave links below so you can go to their website. They've got loads and loads of things. As I said, it's not just acrylic jewellery. Um, they do tons of things and there's different themes, like there's creepy themes. They do a lot of fairy tale jewellery as well. And if you're interested in like Alice in Wonderland, Dracula, Frankenstein, that kind of thing, they've got loads and loads of things like that. Another thing that I thought I'd mention, they've recently started doing a subscription box. I don't believe that they've actually um, shipped the first ones yet. But what they do is they create a necklace each month and it's not one that you're able to actually buy on the website. It's one that they design for each month. They do a gothic box, which is the one that I've subscribed to, and a fairy tale box, which it sounds nice, but it doesn't appeal to me as much. I think it was about £17 a month, including the shipping, which sounds pretty good. And yeah, I just thought it was a really nice idea. So if you guys also want to see what's in the box each month, please just comment somewhere below and I'll think about doing that. I've also decided that I'm going to try my hardest to film one video a week because um, I feel like I've been kind of filming weekly videos anyway, even though I'm really busy in work. I'm going to try and upload on a Monday and see how it goes. I've never had like a set date for uploading videos before, but I feel like if I set myself a target that I might actually try and get videos up on time. Thank you guys so much and hello to my new subscribers. I'll see you guys all again soon. Bye.